Hi, Jolyn. How you doing? Okay, I think there's a little bit of a misunderstanding in what I'm getting from your writing here. You're saying you've decided on Audrey Hepburn as your iconic entertainer, but we're, we have to choose four entertainers. So you're going to do a create a, a stamp series using four iconic American entertainers. Now, my recommendation, if you're going to use Audrey Hepburn, I would find three other uh, iconic American entertainers from the same era as Audrey Hepburn. So. Um, I, when it, well, she was around in the 60s, I believe, right? So I would choose four act, actresses or actors or four iconic American entertainers from the 60s just to keep that conceptual uh, tie, you know, right in there and consistent, okay? Um, so I will go ahead and take a look at your images when you post this Sunday, but the, keep that in mind, though. So, you know, one of the things you want to just really think about consistency. So, for example, if you're four entertainers, um, are they going to be in character or you're going to be depict them as the actress herself or is she gonna is she gonna be um uh the character from breakfast and tiffany's or is she going to be audrey hepburn you see what i'm saying and then your next one just follow that lead so if you're she's going to be the character from breakfast and tiffany's your next iconic american entertainer make sure they're in in character and then that and, and then the other two in character as opposed to like showing one as a picture of the, an image of the actress and then the next an image of the actress in character do you see what i'm saying so you want to really maintain what i'm pointing at here is consistency in the series Okay, so that's fantastic. So what we'll do next is we'll go ahead and take a look at your, if you want to post images here, that's great. Post them in line, you know, embed them right in your body copy. I think you'll get a lot of, a lot more comments from your peers if, if the images were included and posted, uh, you know, embedded right in your body copy. So feel free to repost with the, the images intact. Um, and right here, it's, it looks like you're going, it alludes to the fact that you're going to be portraying Audrey Hepburn in character. So if that's the case, think about uh, four other, three other entertainers and, you know, in character from the same era. And I think, I mean, these aren't requirements. These are suggestions to really solidify the consistency of the series itself. So food for thought, more or less, right? Um, so let me know if you have any questions. If you want to repost with your images, that's great. If you want to repost with your other three uh, choices, that's great too. Otherwise, you know, uh, I'll just go ahead and take a look at your final submission on Sunday and we'll take it from there. Okay, thanks, Joe. Any questions, please feel free to give me a holler. Thank you.